if I ask you what car fits best, wearing a tailored suit or a biker's jacket? What car would you drive? Something fast? Something big. And now, the Lincoln Continental Town Car, a sedan of size, dignity that moves on the widest stance in the land. Lincoln Continental, Continental Mark IV. Two cars that prove a point. Something heavy. Well, actually, Wheels of Steel was going to be about a steam train, an American car. Wheels of Steel. 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 And you really can't drive this car without dressing up nice. So let's go. Nice. All right, so I'm gonna give you a really brief tour of the dashboard. There's your driver's side control with six-way power seats, the remote mirror, and for 72, there is no right-hand mirror. Uh, voltmeter, fuel. Now, there's a fuel light here, which is not controlled by the same relay. That's an interesting story. Now, related to fuel, what I have here is a float from the fuel sending unit. So I go to Dead Man's Curve. Some of you guys know what that is. And it was the first one. I go there. Let's get the choke off. There we go. I filled up, or at least I thought I filled up. I start the car and fuel gauge, nothing. So I'm freaking out. There's traffic like a hundred cars from the 50s, 60s and 70s trying to get out of the Sheridan in Mawa. Now I'm gonna run out of gas. So I get there, I fill it up, it takes two gallons. And <laughs> this is what happened actually. The fuel tank was full, but the sending unit was bad. It got fuel inside of it. The solder between these two clamshells opened up and obviously fuel got in. What's so crazy about it? Nothing. Except this was in 2009 and there's still fuel in it. I microwaved it. Yes, I microwaved it. Don't do that. I put it in an oven. I did everything to try to see, okay, if fuel goes in, it must go out, right? Nope. 2009, it still got fuel from then. I'm not superstitious, but the day this thing doesn't have any more fuel in it is the day the world ends. Anyways, so we got your turn signals. Uh, brake lights when the brakes are low, the door when the door is open. The most annoying buzzer in the world. You have your temperature, oil pressure, and clock. AM, FM, stereo, quadraphonic. You have your fastened seatbelt light, antenna. This is the cruise control model. And the probably most notable thing is the climate control. And notice you set a temperature and it adjusts itself by a vacuum computer. Yes, there's a, such a thing as a vacuum computer. This is not an ashtray, or rather not a cigarette ashtray. This is called a cigar ashtray. That's actually what they call them. Glove box. Most of you guys know these have a lap belt. Right, and it plugs into there. And also, shoulder belts, which there were not mandatory, so they're grandfathered in. You don't have to wear them still. One thing that was kind of, well, very rare, was this. This is the recline function. Push back. And push up. There you go. Both the 73 and my 72 have this. This is one. Of, this is basically what makes this car one of one. This weird option. So let's go on a drive. You knew that was coming, right? I gotta be precise. 16.794. This is fuel 74. There you go. There's a 19.92 miles per gallon. Thank <laughs> you. 
avoid those potholes. Yeah, and still get them on the rear. And that's the thermometer speedometer. See that? Three times fast. Yeah, we're going way too fast. Oh, I'm gonna about to exit. I'm not uh, comfortable doing 100 miles an hour on 20, 30 year old tires, if you know what I mean. So let's go find a nice spot so I can say goodbye to all you people. So there you have it. Looking good, feeling good, cars running good. And at the end of the day, that's pretty much all that we want, right? It doesn't take a lot to make a car guy happy. And I'm just gonna remind you, if you like this, if you know somebody that's into cars, especially into Lincolns, share it with others. I really would appreciate that. This is Rip Roaring Garage, where oil is thicker than blood. Yep. Tra la 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 Where's the street? Like if you like, you like. Like the like if you like. Snap deeps, that is. Heard him out deeps. Heard him out, it's not that. Hello, bus. Hello, ranchero. I'm gonna just stop here.